Over the next two weeks or so, Edward Russell will be getting on his bike as he explores the length and breadth of Taiwan's famous cycling route number one, taking in plenty of sights and sounds along the way. He begins his travels in the east of the country in Hualien, a region famous for long bicycle trips. here in Hualien on the east coast of the island and it's also the starting point for the king of the mountain race a real endurance test that takes cyclists to altitudes of more than 3,000 meters I'm gonna leave that one to the professionals though and instead I'm going to take the slightly less intense cycling route number one which at 968 kilometers is the longest cycle route in the world with that in mind I think I'd better get a move on Hualien is a picturesque county surrounded by both oceans and mountains, offering cyclists a diverse choice of trails and paths while taking in an abundance of scenic views. Although I'm choosing to take the mountain trail, the East Rift Valley here is quite gentle, with an average gradient of only 2%. Cycling really is a great way to discover a new place, as it allows you to travel slowly but efficiently while really taking in the surrounding scenes. And when my legs start to tire and are in need of a bit of a break, well, I can always rely on a little help. One of the great things about Taiwan is that if you ever get tired of cycling, trains like this can take you all across the country and there's plenty of room for your bike too. With numerous well-maintained cycle paths throughout the country, sitting atop a bicycle really is the best way to explore Taiwan. Despite the intense heat of the summer, local farmers are still busy harvesting their crops. Here we are now at Qishang Township in Taidong. Mr. Brown Avenue is a small country road that has become wildly popular due to its starring role in a TV commercial. The now famous location attracts numerous visitors most of whom come by bike. Riding in Taidong, I ran into two elementary school children and their teacher, putting in some hard work as they prepared for an upcoming adventure. They planned to cycle around Taidong during their summer vacation, and I wished them all the success. 